Some of you were around 20 years ago when a new model came around allowing the audience to pick upcoming music artists. That experiment was called American Idol and it launched many successful careers and also showed some vision in that the elites didn't always make the best choices for who and who should not be produced. It's 20 years later, and perhaps it is time for a revolution in the movie, film, and content creation industry. A revolution that lets us crowdfund content creation and the entertainment and creators that we want to see get funded and be able to get a piece of the pie as well. Well, today we have a project joining us that is intriguing. Quick way to explain it is they are a launch pad for video and entertainment ideas. This is not a sponsored video, though I am investing at the recommendation of a friend, and I invite you to join me for my video conversation with Rightstream to learn even more. Welcome to the Crypto Rain channel. I'm your host, Jay Rain, and if you like money and you like crypto, and you're looking for a real investor's take on the crypto market, join the Rainmaker family by liking this video and subscribing with that all notification bell enabled. I am not a financial advisor. I am a crypto investor myself i think about the crypto market and specific cryptos i like i want to thank our patreon members um you do get special access to a discord if you join us there it is a closed group and i'm able to discuss even more about what i think there all right make it rain on that like button and strap in for the show and let's welcome right stream ceo riaz meta hey, thanks for having me on the show how are you fantastic now, it's been fun reading through some of the content um, related to Rightstream and more about what it is and digging through. And I, I appreciate you taking the time to not only join myself, but join the audience to share more about Rightstream. It's my pleasure. Now, I, as I was reading through it, I was looking at your background and your team's background, and it's impressive. You've sold shows in 50 countries. You've been an International Emmy Award nominee, and you founded Imagine TV as well as Eddie Tan, who was on your team, worked at Fox, Disney, and NBC. I guess this is the kind of background I wanted to see and hoped I would see and, and did see as I was looking at the team's background. So, um, could, yeah, uh, could you tell the audience more, in your words, what Rightstream is and what you're wanting to accomplish with it? Yeah, absolutely, Ray. Um, Rightstream is... Uh, a platform for creators to be able to fund their creative concepts uh, through NFTs and via the community, and really to empower creators. And, you know, historically, they've been at the mercy of the big studios, broadcasters, investors, and so forth. And now we let the community engage with the creators and allow the community to own a piece of the action, so to speak, uh, it, when these creative ideas come to life. But it's a lot more than that. It's a, in, complete ecosystem. We also have a B2B platform where content can be monetized. And uh, that also is the revolutionary business model, which I'll explain in a bit more detail later. And then we have a consumer app that you can stream content uh, that's uh, either produced through our platform or through other sources as well. And uh, best of all, you can actually earn our right tokens when you uh, watch content on our platform. And you know, Netflix doesn't pay you to watch. We do. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> they, they sure don't. They charge you. <laughs> That's right. So, um, yeah, so I guess more in depth. Now, you've had a lot of uh, background in the TV industry and probably you see firsthand what some of the big problems are that you're trying to solve. Now, businesses who thrive solve a major need in a marketplace. Could you expand more on what you think that need is that hasn't been correctly served that your the right stream will better address? So the need is with regards um, funding of content. And uh, I've been a creator myself for over 17 years now. And if I look at the creator's journey, you come up with an amazing idea and it might be a film script or a TV show idea and then to bring that to life, you would have to go and pitch it to, if it's a TV show, probably to a broadcast network. And statistics show that probably about one in 2,200 shows that are pitched to a network in the United States actually gets to a full series. Now, you can imagine the odds of success are incredibly low. It's like, that's if you get the chance to get through the door. Most people don't even get through the door. And a lot of creative ideas 
die before they even have a glimmer of hope of actually coming to life. And that's where I think the industry needs fundamental transformation because creativity is out there and uh, the funding sources can't keep up with that creativity at the moment. Now, once we can actually connect community to the, uh, to the creator, then everything changes because your fans, the people that are going to be watching this content are going to be your greatest supporters and they'll back you in these projects and then they can enjoy the success. And uh, imagine if you had actually invested in Star Wars 50 years ago, right? If, um, and even on one, 1% of that movie, it would still be making money 50 years on, still in the dollars, right? And that's the opportunity that we're giving the community and the, the creators by creating this launch pad. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Now, not having Does been that in that industry myself, yeah. I imagine there are like several gatekeepers, but they hold all the keys to all the major important gates, right? And so if you have an idea and you don't know them well, you might have the best idea in the world, but you might not even make it to speak to those gatekeepers. Is that kind of one of the problems that um, like, and so a lot of content that possibly would be some of the best um, series and movies made never do get made because they don't either right. make it to the gatekeepers or make it past them. Yeah, and uh, you got it spot on. And in fact, this is on a much bigger scale than in American Idol because even in Idol, you'll see thousands of people turn up for these auditions and the odds of being picked of being, you know, the top, 40 or 50 people that actually make it to Hollywood, so to speak, are extremely low. And, it, you know, the machinery that goes behind that, it is quite complex the way the decisions are made and so forth. And it's not, um, it's not entirely democratic in, in, in a sense, right? Mm -hmm. So what we are doing now is we give the community the ability to participate in these projects and they make the decisions. And so depending on the strength of uh, the creative idea and how well you position yourself as a creator, then the community will decide, right? It's a, it's a bit like crypto projects that go on to a launch pad. And we'll be doing something kind of similar that we'll have a curation process for the very high value project to ensure that our community is also pr protected. But then once it launches and the community decides on how much money they put in, how they back that project. And uh, that actually determines its path to success ultimately. So I believe that this is American Idol times a thousand X basically. Yeah, because it was fun watching people yeah. perform, right? And voting, but then you didn't really have a stake in it. Whereas in this, if, exactly. Uh, if you invest in a project, you have a lot larger stake in it. You could have a nice financial return if you're right exactly. as well. Now, um, so what do you envision Rightstream will look like in, say, two years and even 10 years down the road? All right. So let's take a look probably two years down the road first, right? Um, within two years, we see tier one projects being produced on, uh, on, uh, on our uh, platform. And by that, I mean, they're not necessarily a $100 million Hollywood production, but they are a quality production. You know, it could be a $20, $30 million production with uh, A-list actors attached to it. And we believe that that itself is going to be a game changer. And now we're looking at this two-year horizon. They also see that we'll have a lot of metaverse partnerships where the content that we create on, on the platform will be streamed in right stream cinemas in the metaverse. Uh, in parallel, we're having conversations with the major fives in Hollywood to bring uh, new content into the metaverse using our right stream cinemas that we're building with certain partners at the moment. So within two years, I kind of see that A, that we, we would have awesome content being produced on a platform a very thriving community and and these film and TV NFTs being traded on our platform as well. And uh, 
the products that are created on our platform as well as Hollywood content, mainstream content, will also be streamed in the metaverse in the right stream cinemas that we are building. And of course, we'll have a vibrant community utilizing our right stream app. They'll be earning these tokens and this amazing ecosystem that will be growing. Now, that's in the short term. If I project this out, say, 10 years uh, or even five years, um, 10 years is a very long time in a startup journey. So e even in five years, I would anticipate that we would have, you know, big budget movies, you know, the scale of a Marvel, for example, being produced on, on a platform and the community being able to own a piece of that action. The technology for uh, watching content in the metaverse and experiencing the metaverse would have progressed dramatically by that stage. And that whole experience is going to change as well. And we, we, we see that we, we would probably have our own studios within the metaverse where you'll be able to engage um, with content, with uh, producers, with uh, the entire ecosystem in a way that is not even imaginable today. So uh, it's a really, really exciting future out there. And we are at the forefront of that. It's going to be amazing to see how the metaverse changes uh, content, like uh, the content we watch and how we watch it. I'm, I'm intrigued with how that all comes together. And what's funny is this shift is going to have huge impacts on like a lot of the major studios and just because a lot of the revenue will be shifted to other viewing streams, right? Much like um, Redbox and then Netflix changed the blockbuster paradigm, right? Blockbuster and Hollywood Absolutely. video and movie rental places, they, they got wrecked because they didn't adapt as consumers were adapting and the technology was adapting. That's exactly it. And the change is happening now. And that's why we're so passionate about what we're doing in, about blockchain technology, because this is the transformation. And there's, you know, the, the big players, they're always slow to move. You know, uh, Netflix was a startup once upon a time, and they changed the paradigm. And now they're part of the current paradigm. And uh, they, they won't adapt as quickly. So this is where players like ourselves come in, in uh, into the space and we become the net, net, next Netflix. We become the ones that shift that paradigm. And ultimately, there'll be someone else, you know, 10 years down the track, 15 years down the track. But <laughs> it, it needs um, pioneers. And this is what we're doing today. Yeah, absolutely. Now, you have a token launch coming up on some of the biggest launch pads. Um, which definitely gets my attention, Engine Starter and VPAD, or v, uh, VLaunch. VLaunch, uh, Chris from MM Crypto is somebody, I, I used to watch his channel when I was new in crypto in 2017, 2018. He is one of the best um, project screeners out there, in my opinion. He used to do videos on upcoming ICOs in 2018, and he had the best track record. So I was really excited when he created a launch pad V launch because he's really, really picky. And so, um, yeah, it's nice that you're coming out on such a big launch pad. Um, could you tell us about launch dates and um, when this is all happening? Yeah. And, and before I do, I, I, I'll definitely say that about Chris. I mean, he is picky and, you know, we went through quite a, an extensive screening process to actually end up on V launch. Um, and we had many, many conversations and calls, but he, he's an amazing individual. And I think um, uh, when, when he believes in something, then he, he does it wholeheartedly, right? He's just that kind of guy. So we're very happy to be on VLaunch. We're happy to be on Engine Starter. We also have a partnership with Oxbow. And we just signed up another one uh, called Firestarter as well. It's relatively new, but awesome people behind that one. So keep a lookout for that. Um, so the idea is actually starting tomorrow. And uh, it, it's, it's running for the next few days on different launch pads. And subject to market conditions, uh, we're looking to list our token on the 10th. Uh, but you know, okay. it all depends on how the market tracks in the next few days. So that's not a hard commitment, but that's what we're aiming for at this point. Makes sense. 
Well, thank you for joining us today and sharing with my viewers more about Rice Stream. It'll be a lot of fun to watch this project over the coming years. A lot of my audience, we're here for the longer term, not just probably feel like another leg of this bull run is coming up. And then there will be a crypto winter that follows, likely. And, and then there will be a massive bull run again. Yeah. And so we'd like to get a feel for solid projects out there that we can track their progress find ones that we like and that we buy during times and we hold uh, for longer periods of time. So thank you so much for joining us, Rias. Thank you so much for having me today. It's been a real pleasure. All right. And thanks for your support. Sure thing. Now, are you ready to be a rainmaker and join the Navy SEALs of crypto and level up your crypto game? I know that this contrarian approach that I use coupled with fundamental analysis Add in a lot of patience. It works really, really well over time. If you haven't already, consider that all notifications bell. And then just tune in when you see our videos pop up. We do a live, live stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 11 a.m. Pacific time. And now also an additional VV special live stream on Wednesday evenings at 7.30 p.m. Pacific. And then we have shorter videos that launch throughout the week, such as this one. Thank you so much for joining us, and we will see you next time. And remember, no rain, no gain. To the space, chasing all of the games, chasing yeah. the pumps and all of the hype trains. But like in life, uh, shit, right before you could, was told to buy when it was pouring like a rain, make a shirt. I buy when it's down, don't chase the boats that I miss, uh, cause I always made the time in mind. I sit the one out, cause I'm patient like that, and I'll wait for the right time. I sell when it's high, I buy when it's low. They call me rich, they call me smart. I'm just a rainmaker running the show. Calculated investments, I don't leave with my heart. Uh, principles are simple, they're leaving a mark. Yeah. Why when it's boring, just gotta be smart. Yeah. I sell when it's hype, like all the channels they pump it. That's when I was selling a parabolic and dunk it. They call me rich, they call me smart. Uh, I'm a rainmaker, making my own star. I'm with the future, learning the past. Makes it time fly by, years going so fast. The game plan is mine, I'll own it now. When I reach the top, haters asking me how. Cause I'm a rainmaker. Investments I love And I follow what I learn Not relying on luck uh, Time is never better The time like the present This next five years is a gift And it's feeling like heaven I'm committed to learn To study and to know that Nothing comes easy But when knowledge the game show Sinking at best run Cause soon will come a bear market Learning and growing And when it's slow would be the target They say it's come out Bitcoin is dead The massive decreases Can get to your head Sticking around The time is better I'm strong like that I'll let the others be fretters Two years time The ball will bring back the game that makes it worth the effort cause here comes the rain So let's go rain makers, let's make it all happen The goal of the hate, let the haters be crapping I'm here for five years, let's do this together The time is right, the time could be better They call me rich, they call me smart I'm a rain maker, making my own start I'm with the future, learning the past Makes it time fly by, years going so fast This game plan is mine, I'll own it now When I reach the top, haters asking me how Cause I'm a rain maker, investments are low And I follow what I learn not with line and look uh, Haters be hating, but time to slow down no. Addressing what they say when I'm wearing my crown my They're chasing crown. green candles like someone who was new I got a vision that was bigger helping me to push through, push through. I'm still human and sometimes it is rough it is. And that's what makes me special, simply I stay tough yeah, Cause I'm a rainmaker, investments I love And I follow what I learn, not relying on luck uh.